Hello, my name is Eric. Today, I'm going to be reviewing my Lego horse. My, well, my Lego motorized horse. Okay. So first, we have stairs that can come off, and then a sign that shows how tall you're supposed to be in order to be able to ride the ride. And here's a crank that operates it. There, this should be there. And so you just crank this, and it goes. And I'm going to be showing you how to motorize it in a little bit. I don't know why I put these on here, but I had them on there. And then. Use Bullseye from the Toy Story 3 Lego set series, and then I got a little minifigure there. And let me show you what's inside here. So there's a that bumps up the it bumps up the horse whenever it spins. Really a pretty simple mechanism, and I'm going to be showing you how to motorize it. Okay. Okay. So first of all, turn it upside down and pull this out. And you put a M sized motor and just get a get one of these three stead long axles with a cross axle on two of the studs and then a gear and then take it and you put it on there here got it put it on there and you plug it in hands today. No, sorry. 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 Ah, there. I'm going to turn it upside down. And put this in the groove. motor. Sorry, everything is falling apart on me right now. Uh, put that back on. Put this back in. And then you can just really use like any motor, or well, any battery box you want. I just use this Technic one. So, like it and you can always take it off and more or just crank it by hand and I'm and that's pretty much it for this video please subscribe leave a like comment if you like this video and I'll see you all in the next video bye